Oh my goodness, ladies and gentlemen, when people talk about can't miss matchup, this is what they are talking about. I am Coach Josh Gary, and it is my pleasure to bring to you from the Gate City Battle here in Greensboro, North Carolina, at the Firestar Pro Wrestling Training Academy. We have a tag team match that I have been looking forward to for a while. We have the Firestar Faithful and TGA Alexander Moss in the ring right now, and he is teaming up with a Luke Skywalker of flight, Cam Carter, and they are taking on the international superstars, Blanco Loco with the mask, and Joey Osborne there on the apron. This is going to be a barn burner for sure. International superstars made their debut here in Firestar Pro Wrestling not too long ago. Alexander Moss, a recent graduate of the Firestar Pro Wrestling Training Academy. Cam Carter, one of the first graduates of the Firestar Pro Wrestling Training Academy. And both longtime fan favorites here in Greensboro, North Carolina. All four men are equally talented, and they will be putting each other to the test here tonight. Referee Ben Grayson there to make sure it is called right down the middle, and I, I am just excited to be here. It is an honor to be nominated. Isn't that what they say at the Oscars? But this is going to be one for the ages. I've been looking forward to this one for a while. Alexander Moss, a relative newcomer to pro wrestling. Joey Osborne is not, so we're going to see if he's going to be able to to give the youngsters some lessons here and some technical wrestling. And Alexander Moss definitely has the athleticism and the quickness here to be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Joey Osborne, who, as you can tell, he is a stereotypical wrestler. He has the look, he has the ability, has the agility there. There we go, easily reverses back into a hammerlock. And there is the braggadocious nature of Joey Osborne right there. Anything you can do, I can do better. And he just showed us right there. Superstar is not just a fancy moniker that they use. They are indeed that. An international to boot. A matching teal and purple gear. I like it. Big test of strength from the two bigger guys in this matchup. That's where the power comes from. Cam Carter and Blanco Loco are the speed and the agility. This is gonna have everything a pro wrestling fan is going to want in a tag team match. All for your viewing pleasure here from Greensboro, North Carolina. Look at that. Going tit for tat, reversing counters. Technical, basic building blocks of wrestling. Feeling each other out here. Oh, wait a minute, there we go. Putting that torque on the knee and the ankle of Alexander Moss. Getting that leverage on the other leg. There we go, there's a little bit of Technique for the youngster spins himself around, able to able to use his free leg to worm out of that. That's pretty good. It's like Joey Osborne's test and see what the youngster knows. Looking for that opening, and he's going to strike as soon as he sees us. Alexander Moss needs to be on his game here if he expects to pick up the win with his tag partner Cam Carter here. Counters it into a hammerlock. Puts him up, takes him down, hangs on to it, forms it into the armbar, pulls him away from the ropes. Good veteran move from Joey Osborne. Joey Osborne and Blanco Loco do not care what the fans think here in Greensboro. They are here to wrestle. They are here to win. And that's what pro wrestling is all about when you break it down to its barest form. Are you better than the man that you are standing across the ring from? And they are here to prove it. They're traveling up and down the roads every weekend, every week, trying to prove that they are some of the best out there right now. And Alexander and Cam Carter are here to show that they're not too shabby. Oh, wait a minute. Big arm drag from Alexander. Another big one. It sends Joey reeling, and he's taken back into his turnbuckle to kind of think about that. He might have taken, uh, taken his eye off the prize and underestimated the young TGA here. Alexander asking the fans if they want Cam Carter. They said, yep. Here comes Cam, Joey tags in Blanco Loco. And here we go, we come the speed and the agility of these two teams. Behind, goes under, lay down, rolls through. Ducks under the leapfrog. Whoa, goes for the big right. That ducks, catches him with the leg scissors. Blanco's able to deflect some of it, it starts to reel. There's a reason Cam Carter was invited back to Chikara Pro Wrestling after his showing at the King of Trios tournament. 
Snap bears over, kicks, ducks under, standing moonsault, lands it, kick to the head. These guys are well aware of what each individual can do. Hits him with the shoulder tackle right as he heads out. Just, whoa, backs away. Campart is able to take flight and woo! Psych! Did you see how he ricocheted off those ropes? See what I did there? Superhero pose in the middle of the ring goes Cam Carter Blanco Loco checking with his tag partner Joey Osborne saying, hey, we might have underestimated these guys. We might have to turn it up a notch. Flips back into the ring. Showboating, showing off that speed and agility, but Cam Carter's got some two. Corkscrew, European one, two. And Blanco, Loco, Blanco Loco able to kick out very easily. It's still early in this matchup. It is anybody's game. Too early to call. And it looks like the former training partners, TGA and Cam Carter, working together like a fluid team like you would expect the international superstars to. Plants him firmly on the mat. Referee Ben Grayson being very liberal with these counts. Up and, oh my gosh, standing 450 with the assist. One, two, and Blanco even kick out before the three count. TGA and Cam Carter firmly in control here. Sends him up, goes over. Oh, there's some of that tag team that Alexander was able to catch it and Oh, wait a minute, Joey with the trip. Blanco with the advantage, taking advantage. Two and only a two count. TGA able to kick out. Blanco Loco mushing Cam Carter, which understandably makes him upset. He comes to try and drag in, and there goes some of that behind the referee's back type stuff that you'd expect out of the most heelous teams out there. Joey and Blanco working like the well-oiled machine they are. A formidable tag team and singles competitors in their own right. Look, you want to tag? There, we tag. Blanco logo back in here. Tagged again, playing by the rules. Very wary of what they do inside the squared circle. Not wanting to break the rules, not wanting to get disqualified too. And TGA still kicks out before the count of three. Joey Osborne making sure that he sticks on TGA like a fly on Stank. Make sure that he's not able to get over there and tag Cam Carter. Blanco Loco up on the top rope, low ceiling. He thinks twice about it. Kick to the ribs, sends him into the turnbuckle. Sometimes depending on the building you're in, you may have to adapt your game to the environment that's around you. TGA not going down without a fight, fighting back. Kicks and punches, trying to create separation. Spins him around. Joey, big clubbing forearm, clothesline to the back. Here he goes, European to the back. And here he comes, big sliding German from Blanco Loco. One, two, and able to kick out. Cam Carter was sliding in for the save, but TGA was able to kick out. Referee Ben Grayson making sure that Cam Carter stays in his corner, giving him a warning, almost like a warning shot before he pulls the trigger on that disqualification. And of course, Blanco Loco taking advantage of the referee being distracted over there in Cam Carter's corner. Taking advantage of the, oh my goodness. TGA is out there on an island right now and Cam Carter is desperately trying to get over there and save his partner. Joey Osborne and Blanco Loco working together very well here at the Gate City Battle. As a coach, I have to admire the, the swiftness, the fluidity of these two as competitors. If you have not seen these two gentlemen perform before, I ask you, find where they're gonna be, where you're at, and go see them live. They are an impressive duo. Swings him up off the ropes. Catch him, goes to the double close. Ducks under, and oh, three Stooges, the international superstars. Blanco's over to catch him, and TGA gets planted with the knee. Oh, big knees to the face with the assist from Joey. Two, and Cam comes in and breaks up the count. Ben Grayson, of course, once again in modest, you gotta wait for the legal tag. 
The referee is the sheriff inside the squared circle and they must be respected at all times. And you notice that Blanco Loco and Joey Osborne are respecting them in their own fanciful way. He's got his leg draped over the throat of Alexander Moss there, Ben Grayson, letting him know, hey, I see what you're doing there. Breaks, breaks the hole before he can be disqualified. That is a smart move from a veteran right there, ladies and gentlemen. Maximizing the rules to your but just the maximum. You know, pushing it as far as you can go. He's got that abdominal stretch firmly locked in. You notice he's got the, the leg great by there. And if he's able to get his left foot wrapped behind the knee of Alexander Moss, really put some torque on that groin. But Alexander's able to kick it off, and Blanco sees it. Before Alexander's able to do something, he's able to give him a couple shots. Go back firmly in control, throws him off the ropes, catches it. Oh, wait a minute. Trying to go for a back suplex. Blanco Loco saw it coming. Was able to stop it up. Catches him this time and drops him on the back of his head. This is Alexander Moss's opportunity. If he can get over there and tag Cam Carter, this could be their chance. Cam Carter trying to get the crowd here in Greensboro involved. Try to get them in here. Referee starts his count. Can Alexander get over there and tag Cam Carter? Can Blanco Loco make the tag to Joey Osborne? We're up to four, five. Both men are stirring. Blanco Loco is closer. Tag, tags on both ends. Here we go, Cam Carter flying in like a house on fire. Takes Joey Osborne down, knocks it out of the way. Big right hand, big European. Kicks, misses, catches him on the rebound. He is on, oh, wait a minute. Joey's been there, seen this before. Blocks the attack, sets him up. Up, oh, miss. Oh, Joey able to catch him on the rebound. Spins him up and down and drives him down. Come on, Cam, one, two, and Blanco able to break up the count, and we are still rolling here in Greensboro. This is one of those matches that is fast and furious, and I'm sorry if I don't get it all. It spins it around, double underhook, spins it around again. Oh my gosh, S sets him up, here we go. Big power bomb, no, fights it off. These guys are going move for move. It's kind of one of those, if you luck out, get that knockout blow. Oh, wait a minute, he caught it. I don't think so, homie. Sets him up, drives him down, holy smokes. Cam Carter is out. Blanco's got to get him back in the ring. TJA's back up, spins him around. Drives the knee, <laughs> just see the jelly legs of TGA. Catches the gear, spins him around, hits him again. This looks like a scene from Full Metal Jacket. Guys playing everywhere, power bomb. I'm not even sure I know who's legal. I hope Ben Grayson does. Because this is going everywhere. Corkscrew. Oh my gosh. All four men are down. And the crowd here in Greensboro is loving it. I told you this was going to be a Gate City battle. And they have not let anyone in this building down. And there it goes. This is awesome chance from the fans here in Greensboro. And fans, this is only the type of stuff that you can see at Firestar Pro Wrestling, trying to bring you some of the best talent in the Southeast and along the Eastern Seaboard. Nothing like watching it on YouTube or on your computer at home, but it is everything to see it live here on Medley Street. It's like 3D theater. Cam and Joey Osborne trading blows back and forth. Meat smacking, knuckles cracking. There we go, tag to Blanco Loco. Pops him up, big right. Sets him up. Oh my gosh! Flat to the chest, two and three, no! Only a two count, two and nine tenths. Cam Carter kicked out. He's still alive. Joey Osborne can't believe what he is seeing. The young Firestar duo is still alive here against the international superstars. Joey Osborne calling for it. Cam Carter fighting it off. Oh, wait a minute. Inadvertent activity. We've got the tag to GGA. Blanco doesn't see it. Comes in. Knocks 
him out. That's the ball game. One, two, three, and that is it. TGA and Cam Carter pick up the win. Oh, my God. The international superstars may have lost this matchup here in Greensboro, but they have not come. They, I, don't, I don't even know what to say. These guys are fantastic. They may have lost the match, but they did not disappoint. They put their all against this team of Camp Carter and TGA who have come up with the win here at the Gate City Battle. This may not be the last you have seen of these two as a team, this may not be the last you've seen of the international superstars here in Firestar. Oh my gosh, this was a match for the ages, and I am getting fanned from my own music guy. You can see the steam coming off of me. If I were a machine, I would need some maintenance, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh, my name is Coach Josh Gary, and you just witnessed the classic for the ages.